history is staring South Oak Cliff in the face. You see, they could be the first DISD team to win a state football championship since Booker T. Washington did in 1958. Take a look at the team, because here's where things get awesome. He was excited. I was excited, too, because I was his girlfriend. <laughs> Nisa Muhammad's husband, Abdul, who is no longer alive, was on that team in 58, a defensive tackle. Such a great accomplishment for the city of Dallas. And three of their grandchildren? I just found out about it uh, not too long ago, but, man, that, that, that's big to me. All start on defense for Sock this year. It means a lot. You know, just the uh, bloodline going back from that far. Malik and Abdul Muhammad play in the secondary while Billy Walton plays defensive end. And all three have been playing. Uh, the kids get to see where all this talent comes from. Since they were little. My granddad was always about family and football. Our family now is still the same. He was about passing something on to his kids so that they could pass it on to the next generation. Abdul passed in the 90s and never got to meet these grandkids. Biggest foul to everybody. But they say they can feel him. I felt there was something behind me that it was something driving me. So that's where our success come from. And who better to break DISD's championship drought? I know that he is so proud of them. And he's pushing them all the way, just go, go, go. Then the descendants of a man who knew how to win. So history isn't the only thing staring Sock in the face. Bears are going to roar. That's what I tell them all the time. A legacy <laughs> is two. In South Oak Cliff, I'm Matt Howerton.